And we're back with live commentary this time. I really hope this thing doesn't lag too much. So I've gone back to the top, and there is a po to get here. Yes, yeah, I have 48, so only 12 more to go. So 60 pos. Yep. If you get 20, you get a bottle. And if you get 60, you get another prize, which is actually not as good. Uh. Oh, I thought I was going to take fall damage there. Okay, well, this is really lagging badly. Yeah, it is lagging. Um, I think it won't be as bad in the, uh, in the finished video. It's just bad now. Ah, uh, I see. Okay, so the reason I came down here is because I can now smash up these things. Oh, don't. Crap, I always get knocked on my face when I do that. <laughs> Alright. Oh, this game always scare me on the water. How is this game always scary? Yeah, I mean, I think this game was meant to be darker than some of the other Zelda games. I think you can light that lantern and that just gives you money. Um, okay, so what's next? There's another heart piece somewhere. Oh, I had this guy here for a reason. Oh, oh, I know where it is. All right. Is there any convenient warp? I guess Zora's Domain would be the closest one. If I could get... Oh, stupid cursor, please. Oh, I was pointing it too high, maybe? Come on, you can do it. There. You can imagine that, as you can imagine, this ma makes it rather difficult to use a bow. I love how you just are floating in the air. Oh, hi, Zora's Domain. Yep. I don't know why it's lagging so badly this time. I closed every program I could, practically. I was thinking that Firefox and iMovie would be the... Wait a minute. I didn't close iMovie, did I? Okay, I'm going to close iMovie. Okay, now things should be better. Once it actually closes, which it takes a while to do sometimes. I like how Fantasia lags like a Uh, alright. So once I get somewhere where I can change to human form, then I need to figure out where I'm going first. Uh, it's in the northern part of Hyrule Field, so I want to take that branch. Well, I thought it would be better once I closed Dying Movie, but I guess not. No, it's a bit better on my side. Oh, it is better on your side? That's yeah. good. Uh, oh, that's the wrong branch. What am I doing? First of all, can I become a human or am I... Yeah, I was afraid of that. I get a chance when no one's around. I don't get that. Because people don't like werewolves, I guess. Okay, you know what? I'm just going this way. Ah, wolf is faster anyway. Anyway, this is another heart piece that people find very, very annoying. Um, for an entirely different reason. Okay, this is the way I want to go. I think. I hope. Of course, people who have watched my LPs know that I do not have the best sense of direction. Okay, yes, this looks promising. This way. Whoa, I said get up this way. Oh, come on. Stupid <laughs> current. Wow, that current's failure. I just have to look for a big, very out-of-place ice block somewhere around here. 
Wait, no, I think it's further up. Uh, by the way, guys, if I didn't mention it, I am playing left-handed again, so that wasn't me giving up on my challenge only for that one part. I think I should be able to keep it up till the end now. Uh, oh, wait, no. Maybe the else. Else. I, okay, maybe the ice block is not outside the cave. Maybe it's inside the cave. I don't really be able to tell you, so... No, no, I know you haven't played this game before. Um, wait, is this... Am I heading the completely wrong way? Yeah, probably. Um, yeah, that's wrong. Right. And I smack my head on the fence. You do that a lot, you head a lot. <laughs> uh, did, it seems frustrating to navigate. Seems frustrating what? It seems frustrating to navigate. Well, yeah, because I can't really... You mean in general or because of what I'm doing? Yeah, uh, well, the world is very large, and it's just like, it's not like this place is marked or anything, so, kind of difficult to, you know what, I'll look for a description in my guide, because wasting time is not fun for the viewers. Uh, okay, there's a bomb rock in front of it, unless I already blew it up, which is likely. Which would have been stupid of me because it would make the place harder to find. This is the thing I would do. Man. Nom nom nom. Not your face. And of course I can't climb over that because that would be too easy. And I can't. Uh. Okay, this game is making everything difficult for me. Ow. Okay. I think it, of course, I can't see in this. Oh, I think this is it. Uh, one way to find out. Blow it up. You're not dead. That's a problem. Problem set. Okay. Um, am I going... Oh, here we go. Okay, it's also... Oh, you know what? I should probably adjust the angle of my screen. That might help. Yes, that's better. So I didn't go here earlier because you need the ball and chain to smash this. Now we have ice block puzzles. Yay! So there are three progressively harder ones of these puzzles. Uh, and I never use my guide for these because I'm actually pretty good at these. Or at least, I'm usually good. Whether I'm good today, we will see. Okay, I see the solution to this one already. So you push that one down and then push it over and then down and then over again. Yep. Oh wait, no, never mind, that's not the entire solution, that's... Yeah, you push it down yes. and then it's over again. Yeah. No, I, I see... Alright, so one of them... Goes... Okay, now I have one, I can have one one past the... Thing. Oh, okay, yeah, okay, I see the rest. This one is not supposed to be that difficult. Yeah. Oh, I thought it would automatically stop on it. Like... No. Which brings up an important point. You you always have to have one just past where you want the next one to go. Now, of course, if they were using anything resembling real physics, that wouldn't work because the momentum would be transferred and... Yeah. Yeah, then the box would stop. 
Um, all right, so this one's a bit more difficult. This time you have to hit both of you have both there. Yeah. Both of the switches have to be pressed at the same time. I forget which one you're supposed to press first. I'm going to go with the far one from this point of view. Hmm. The problem is that once you have one of the switches pressed, then that block pretty much becomes unavailable for other use. I am not good with these types of puzzles. You what? I'm not good with these types of puzzles. Okay. I see something that may help. I put this one... So, for viewers, if you uh, don't know these puzzles, basically the rule is the block will go as far as it can before hitting either the edge of the area or another box. Okay, that will let me press one of the switches. Now I just need to press the other one. I'm not sure how to press the other one. Maybe use the box behind it and then try and do something. I'm not so sure though. Yeah. Let's see. Well, I have a stopper. The problem is that I can't get a box to this spot. Um, oh wait, I know what to do. Push this here. I said push it. No, wait, that won't... No, that won't solve it, but it'll get closer. Okay, push that one around there. Okay, I think I know what to do now. If Link would actually obey my commands. Yeah, okay, see, now I'm just going to repeat the same thing as I just did with the other block. And now it'll press the switch. Oh, I physics, you fellas. <laughs> I mentioned in the last recording session when I was in Snow Peak Ruins that a good item for Link to have would be ice skates. That would be a good idea, actually. He wouldn't be so slippery on the ice. It's not like he doesn't fall, right? Um, actually, if you change direction quickly on ice, you can fall. Let, let me see if I can demonstrate. Of course, this lag isn't helping. Oh, wait, no. Maybe I'm thinking of a different game. Maybe I'm thinking of, like, Mario. You're thinking of Wind Waker. I know, I know he falls in Wind Waker. Oh, right, right. Okay. So, now, here's the really difficult one. You need four stoppers. Not at the same time, obviously, because you can't do that. Okay, so you have one. There's two. No, you need more than four stoppers, because sometimes you need stoppers. Never mind. <laughs> I'm confusing myself here. You're confusing me, so... So the first part isn't too hard to figure out. You need to get one couple squares away, like this. But now what? And then you push the block down to make it go in the middle and then push uh, that wouldn't work, would it? Um, I'd say get it in the middle, but I don't know how you're supposed to do that. Okay, um, I think I have a start to a solution. Which unfortunately will involve many different pushes, but oh well. Well, I could like pull it in the direction you want it to, it, not about push it. You can't pull it. Yeah, that would make sense. Because there are no handles. <laughs> now it's quite possible that there's a much shorter way to do this than what I'm doing. But I'm just kind of doing what I'm thinking of. <laughs> oh 
Oh, wait a minute. Would that be... Okay, anyway, so I'm moving this block next to the other one. Which means that I'll be able to move a block one spot away from the switch. Now the question is, which one should I do? Hmm. Which one would make it easier? I'm going to go with this one so that we don't have these two blocks that could potentially get in each other's way. Now, oh wait, no, I, I've I've got it now. Only a few more moves. Wait, cause I don't see it at all. So I'm thinking another way, but then I got kind of confused. So. Do you see it now? Yeah. Okay. Fortunately, this is a part that isn't much harder to do left-handed than right-handed. Okay, I actually solved that pretty painlessly. Now if I can actually move like I'm not drunk. Okay. Parts. Wait, five? Wait, you got... Whoa. Yep, five? you need five. Oh, okay. Here's my guess. My guess is that, I mean, I know that this game was, the release of the game was delayed because the developers added to, added, decided to add more levels, which I think was a good thing, because I, I like long games, I like the fact that this game takes a long time. Um, so I'm guessing they already had lots of heart pieces in there, 